A teen shot and killed, ambushed in a Fort Wayne alley. ABC 21's Corinne Rose brings us more on that story tonight. I don't know how we continue on this trajectory involving our youth. Um, something has to give here. Just after seven Wednesday night, 15 year old Eric McDonald Jr. was beaten and shot in an alley off McKee behind Euclid Avenue on the city's southeast side. He was rushed to the hospital and into emergency surgery, but didn't survive. We've seen the violence kind of been on an upswing involving juveniles and and it doesn't seem like it's getting any better. Sergeant Sofia Rosales Catina says it's too early to tell at this point in the investigation whether this shooting is related to others earlier this year that involved teens. However, she says detectives do not think this was a random act. While investigators do have video from some neighbors that shows what happened, police are asking for doorbell or other security video from anyone else who may have caught something out of the ordinary. She says officers are doing what they can to keep the community safe, including taking more than 900 illegal guns off the street last year. But she says if anyone, including a teenager, wants a gun, they're not hard to get. A lot of those were stolen. They're stolen out of cars, people leaving guns in unlocked cars. Uh, easily be obtained that way, and then they're just sold on the street for, you know, a couple, maybe 50 bucks, 75 bucks. Um, it's not difficult to get your hands on one if you really want to. She says the worst part of an officer's job is having to knock on parents' doors to tell them their child will not come home again after a crash or anything else. Even to make the notification that your son or daughter has been involved in, in some kind of uh, shooting or something like that, that's even difficult. But to sit there and go through the emotions that a parent goes through as you're sitting there as a parent yourself, uh, it's hard. It's, it's the worst part for sure. Eric McDonald Jr. is Allen County's fifth homicide of the year. Corinne Rose, ABC 21. If you have doorbell or other security video, or you know something about this case, you're asked to call the Fort Wayne Detective Bureau. That number's at the bottom of your screen. It's 427-1201. Continuing